guys and welcome back to another video so this is gonna be a bit of a different video this time around because unfortunately I could not make a video at the familiar location house right here um, like I do every year and the main reason behind that was because it was raining and thundering for the majority of the time that we were there, which meant we had to obviously stay inside the house here for basically the majority of the time. And obviously I didn't want to get my phone or GoPro destroyed, so yeah. Uh, I know I could have filmed inside only, but that would have been kind of boring. I know you guys like seeing the outside too, so. What I decided to do was right before we left, I didn't have time to make a full-on video because we were leaving. And because by then the rain had stopped. But at the time, we were ready to leave because we had been there for like nine hours. So I took screenshots of the house. Not all of it, but just a few because we were about to leave. So that's what I'll be showing you in this video. Obviously, to kick things off, we of course have the front of the house right here. As in usual tradition, I used all, I used to always, um, uh, you know, showcase that at the beginning of each one. Each video I showcase here. Next up, as you can see, we have the living room right here. There are actually a few differences in here, such as that chair being right there. That chair, I think, actually used to be over here, and then I don't think this ever was actually here before. But I think everything else was. It's actually really cool to see all the differences here. Next up, we have the dining room, and it looks like this. There are some things here on the table, which I will actually show you now, ironically. We have a cake right here. Now, the main reason this was here was because we actually came here the day before my birthday. So, the ones who owned the house decided to just randomly bring one out. Kind of out of nowhere, unexpectedly, because this came out of freaking nowhere. But, oh, sorry. <laughs> Wrong one. But, yeah, we had a cake right here. Obviously, it was all cut up. This was, of course, to celebrate our birthday, which is in, like, a day. So that's really cool because today is Wednesday, June 26th of 2024. Also, congratulate ourselves for it being the earliest we have ever been at this house. In a New York trip, that is. We had not beaten that record since 2016. And after eight years, we finally beat the record. I just didn't expect it to also be on the first day of this entire trip that we came here. And then we have a picture of the dining room from the other side where we can also see the window in the background. Pretty cool. And then, yeah, there's the cake right there again, just with the remains of it. It was really cool, even if it came out of nowhere. But it was also a nice surprise. The final picture we have for this video is the backyard where the garage is. You may notice over here we have the umbrella with all the chairs being some orange and white chairs. We were actually out here for a few minutes before it actually started raining. Like, when we saw that it was about to thunder and lightning, we almost saw, like, a lightning flash, like, right around here. And when we knew that, we ran inside immediately. Because it was raining like nuts. But right beforehand, like, all of us were out here in this specific place over here. And then when we saw that lightning and thunder and rain were coming, yeah, we ran inside immediately. And we never went back out again until we left. So that's another reason I couldn't make the video. And it's why you're seeing it in this format today instead. But just know, it's actually really cool. And that's all the screenshots I took. It's crazy to believe that we actually now beat 2016's record. Because that was on June 29th, 2016. Making it the earliest time in a New York trip ever. We've now officially beat that record by three days. And it only took eight years. <laughs> Woo! Anyway, that is 